faster than a speeding bullet. More powerful than a locomotive. Able to leap tall buildings at a single bound. The infant of Krypton is now the man of steel. Superman! There's something so American and so innocent about the whole idea of comic books. I think comics work because it's a really good way to tell stories. And comics can tell any kind of story there is. It's adventure, it's fun, it's rock and roll. And when you've got movies making billion plus dollars that have guys running around in tights, you know, there's something to that. I like the fans a lot. They're all really cool. They're like, what are you people doing? We're like those people who camp out for Star Wars before the movie comes out. That, that's what we are. This is a St. Patty's Day foam tome, a trash can, and this is the bubble packaging over a toilet brush I bought at Target. I've always wanted to be Batman, and this is the only place where you can legally and sanely be looked at as Batman. My publisher felt that comics were read by very young children and very stupid adults. When I told him I wanted to do Spider-Man, I said, first of all, Stan, people hate spiders. You can't call a hero Spider-Man. Don't you know what a hero is? I consider Neil Adams to be my mentor. Frank came up to my studio and he showed me the work. And he told me my stuff was absolutely terrible. And I thought I should go back to Vermont and forget about it. He said, well, what can I do to fix it? He told me this many, many times as I kept coming back and he kept showing me more and teaching me more. Comics is a collaborative medium. If the writer is where the script begins, you know, the artist is the cinematographer. It really kind of breaks it down and makes it visual. What the anchor does is, in the end, everything's made up of lines, and he is the one that puts in the final line. When I get the page, I just get a black and white image, and then I add the flat colors. It's like being a big kid, and you're coloring a gigantic coloring book full of really awesome stories and really cool characters. Don't listen to anybody who tells you no, because you can do anything. Everyone who reads comic books is now sitting at the cool kids' table, and it's about time because there's a lot of really great ideas coming out of kids who are now sitting at the cool kids' table.